Ever since Facebook was renamed Meta on October 28, 2021, the nebulous Metaverse concept that inspired the new name has been a hot topic of discussion. On our channel, we share thoughts on recent developments in the tech industry. Subscribe not to miss new videos. Here we go. Generally speaking, the metaverse is a network of digital worlds that can include any combination of technologies, from virtual reality to augmented reality and blockchain. The term was coined by Neil Stevenson in his 1992 novel, Snow Crash, to describe a virtual world widely used in his imagined future. In the book, the metaverse is a virtual reality world depicted as a marketplace encircling the planet where virtual real estate can be bought and sold and users wearing virtual reality goggles live in 3D avatars that they can choose the shape of. Let's overview the main terms related to Metaverse. The first is a virtual world. In simple words, it's an online community computing environment that is designed and shared by individuals so that they can interact in a specially created, simulated world. The next point to discuss is virtual reality. It's a fully immersive experience based on computer simulations, in which the user's 360-degree view is completely contained in a 3D digital world. Also, it's worth mentioning a mixed reality. It means an immersive experience that blends the real and virtual worlds, so that users can interact with and manipulate physical and virtual objects in real time. The next term is augmented reality an immersive experience created by integrating computer-generated virtual objects into the user's view. Finally, we give you a definition of a virtual economy. It's an emerging economy that exists in a virtual world, typically exchanging virtual goods in the context of an online game, especially in massive multiplayer online games. Want to know more about the way brands use augmented reality? Jelvik's team prepared an in-depth article about the topic. The link is in the description. Now, once you're familiar with the key industry terms, we can move on to well-known companies offering metaverse products or services. For instance, Second Life allows users to become avatars and communicate with each other in virtual spaces. They enjoy virtual versions of real events, from business meetings to clubs. Users can create their content and services and trade with each other. There's a virtual economy with its currency that can be exchanged for real currency. In its turn, Epic Games, the company that created the popular video game Fortnite, has moved beyond its traditional video games and into social events, such as virtual music concerts and dance parties, where people can dress up in their avatars and build islands. From its part, Snapchat, one of the growing metaverse companies, has announced the launch of a new avatar lens that shows how a user or player will look in the metaverse. Besides, Unity Software, a well-known company for Meta, offers a real-time 3D software development platform with access through augmented reality. It focuses on empowering enterprises with advanced tools and technologies, such as 3D, 2D, virtual reality, and augmented reality to develop metaverse technology. Have you ever used any of these companies' services? Let us know in the comments section below the video. The next question to discuss, is it worth investing in the metaverse? Metaverse empowers companies to revolutionize many industries. Thus, with billions of dollars of projected revenue expected to be made in the metaverse, companies are lining up to get their share. Here are some of the big companies that have already entered the metaverse and are looking to dominate this space in the future. Meta Platforms, Microsoft, Roblox, Nike, and NVIDIA. And what's the future of the metaverse? In the future, don't just look at the technology and norms we have today. Think about what your human experience lacks when you communicate at a distance. Advances in holographic projection, no goggles, motion sensors, and bioscience, tactile feedback, olfactory generation, and neural interfaces. The list goes on. Whether it's writing, speaking, meeting, presenting, singing, acting, or making a film, we strive to get across to the audience and make a connection. The metaverse will eventually become another vehicle for this, not replacing these things, but enabling and enhancing them. So, what do you think about metaverse and its potential for your business? This video was made by the Jelvix team. 
we help the world's leading brands innovate and accelerate digital transformation. We're sharing the latest on technology trends and innovations, so be sure to subscribe not to miss any videos, and don't forget to press the bell button. Also, share what topics we need to cover further on our channel. You can find our contact details in the description box. Bye for now.